Books, page 43. Follow the instructions. Uh, yuck. Oh, I've done this stuff. <laughs> Bethany's changed her look. It suits her. Awesome. Totally awesome. It is an honor and a privilege to, to watch, watch you work. work. Come on, come on. Wednesday's next. Have you ever found yourself discontented by those closest to you? Are you irked by their inability to heed simple requests? Such as, Please don't come to my science fair. <laughs> She's talking about us. <laughs> Do you ever wish you could take their undesirable qualities and eliminate them forever? It can be done. Meet my Uncle Fester. That's my brother. Observe. Turning, isn't it? In stark contrast, however, is Socrates. Are you gonna eat that? This led me to ponder the question. What if personality traits could be extracted and implanted between creatures? Bottoms up. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, all right. Thank you. Thank you. What happened? Welcome to this year's science fair. I'm excited to honor this group of brilliant minds we have before us. Let's proceed. Uh-huh. Oh, you were serious. Everyone who participated! What? That's right. This year we are embracing a new philosophy. Just trying makes you a winner. But how can you be a winner if no one is a loser? Every single one of you is special. Yeah. Disagree. He's not special. Did you see his volcano? What was that? Baking soda? Is this the third grade? It does not count. Great thinkers need obstacles to function. Yet, with every meaningless trophy, I become more and more unremarkable. And with every hug, the more brain cells erode. But, like the phoenix from the ashes, I shall rise above this setback. Together, we shall turn heads, Socrates. Starting with Pugsley. Uh, having fun. 
I'm staring at Canada, if that answers your question. I'm sorry, Wednesday. I know how much you wanted to see where girls your age were burned at the stake. What did you call them again? Squad goals. There's my little holy terror. You know how I feel about hugs, father. <sighs>